everybody and welcome back again to Let's Play God of War. We are still looking for the magic chisel. Oh well, I guess we kind of found it. At least um, I'm led to believe that it's the thing stuck in his head. But we only need like a piece of it probably, so not like the whole thing. <laughs> Would be a little bit too large for us to carry anyway. But yeah, um, I guess we will just move on. Uh, I did destroy some of this stuff already, but since I quit the game in between and started it up again, some stuff has changed. And the pressers that I didn't pick up last time have obviously despawned as well, which is kind of sad. I kind of like to, well, um, save them in case I need them later, but um, they just don't survive, you know quitting and starting the game again. <laughs> All right. That is a very giant giant head of Thamor. How are we getting down there? Oh, the chisel went all the way through his head, and we need to get I to have the a plan. tip. You do? Do not act so surprised. Oh, no offense, brother. <laughs> but I don't even think Thor with Mjolnir in hand could get through that much ice. Then Thor is a fool. <laughs> this should be entertaining. Well, funny that you should mention Thor and the hammer, because we do have, like, a pretty big hammer over here. So, I feel I should be able to make use of a giant hammer that we've seen here, right? Alright, some of you are trying to shoot me with bombs. I've noticed that. Alright, let's get some distance here. Is any one of you trying to... Yep, there we go. And I'm going to use this on the big guy. <laughs> and I'm going to use a lock on you. Right. That is one of you down. So have we more of those? Yep, here we have another one trying to shoot me. And we have another one of the fast guys. <laughs> All right, I should maybe use my chance here to get in a few more hits. Okay, this guy is almost destroyed. There we go. And, um, okay, we have one of the shooty guys over here. We have another fast guy over here. <laughs> Finish off this guy first, and now I'm going to deal with you. Okay. Oh, we are not done yet. Oh, well, nope. <laughs> we are definitely not done. Okay. Um, I guess I'm going to start with the ogre, and why not use my rage now? Not sure if I'm really going to need it for different enemy later, but it might be as good as time as any to, to use it. Alright. And now I can use you to kill off some of the others. There we go. Oh, there's, there's another one over here. Alright. Um, well, apparently, some of you are still alive. There are so many of them. Where, where do they all come from? All right, let me, let me get my bearings here. Oh, suddenly there's two. There's two of uh, these ogres, right? That's what they are. Unbelievable. Okay. Um, I have a 
a rune available. So let me make use of it. We don't have any rage crystals around here. Well, we do have one. <laughs> so I guess I'm just going to use it again. And use the good old ogre weapon again. Specifically against the other ogre. There we go. Fight each other. Kill each other. <laughs> And all right, this one's almost dead. Oh, I still have some rage left. We might be able to finish this over as well. Wow! Come on up! Oh, it's Sindri. <laughs> wherever, wherever you go, Sindri's already been there. Anyway, let's let's pick up some loot first and then we will go and talk to him. I will pick up this one. Don't need any health crystals. Okay. Well, that was exciting. Didn't expect that much resistance here. Okay, let's see if Sindri has some information for us. Wow, that was uh, something, that uh, <laughs> fight. Here, catch. <laughs> well, that was a waste of a perfectly good hour. How were you not seen? I agree. There is nowhere here to hide. Oh, that. It's a little trick my people can pull. A special way of not being seen. <laughs> you can be invisible? More like I can step into the realm between realms. And your mind doesn't understand what it's seeing, so... <laughs> it sees nothing at all. That's how we avoid ever having to actually use the weapons we craft. I see you. <laughs> it, uh... It doesn't seem to work on dragons, though. <laughs> Your brother wanted to know if you're getting enough to eat. I guess I could tell him you are. Brock was asking about me? Was there meat on his breath? <laughs> what are you doing, Kratos? You let him touch this again. <laughs> oh, look at you, Sindri. <laughs> Come on, then. So that's how Brock was in the temple right after the water drop. He stepped between realms. Okay, now, shush. I need complete silence for this. <laughs> there you go. Apparently, their work is really just, like, one... one little, uh, slash of the hammer, and that's it. And I, th I think at this point, the, the dwarves just showing up at every impossible location is like a running gag that never gets explained in any proper fashion. It's like the merchant from Resident Evil 4, right? <laughs> Very well. To business. Oh, look at that. Um, lots of new options here. Hmm. But again, this is something that I will probably you know, do when I have a bit more time and I can read the description of all these different items and then I decide if I want to craft any of that. I mean, some of it looks like it would be nice, but then again, maybe I just want to wait until I have enough materials to craft something like this, you know? I'm always very stingy with my <laughs> materials. Um... Yeah, I can't craft this one anyway. Maybe we can upgrade something. Um, right. I could upgrade this one even more, I suppose. Uh, you know what? Don't I don't suppose you could try keeping that clean. 
And I'm going to wear it. Um, okay. What else can you offer? Well, like, you can't upgrade the Tyr Gauntlet, sadly. Oh, and you have... Oh, now you are selling resources. But that's not really a resource that I need. I need, like, some of the hard steel, I believe. Oh boy, oh boy, look at all these new enchantments. Yeah, I will I will read all of that uh, in in private because that's going to take some time. And a new rune. Huh, I mean, this looks very impressive in, in the preview. Gotta, gotta say that. Um, don't have anything to sell, apparently. Okay. In that case, never mind. Don't let the Draugr get you! Well, the Draugr are honestly the least of my problems. <laughs> okay, um, I will have to equip this one with some enchantments. And since I sacrificed a lot of cooldown for the previous one, maybe I will just increase the cooldown a little bit. And again, I may want to have a closer look at this later and see if I want to replace it. But for now, I'm just going for some increased cooldown. There we go. Okay. It also looks a lot better than the previous one. I like this one. Okay. Now, this was just a quick so, bit of inventory management. Can you guess it? Knowing you, it doesn't involve standing around here. Correct. But how do we move forward? Well, clearly, if we were able to loosen that hammer... Boy, Farmer really liked jewelry, didn't he? He even braided his beard with it. <laughs> I happen to think he looks dashing. You know, for a snow-covered corpse. Yeah, you set up your shop right Once you retrieve the whetstone, please take utmost care while handling mouth. it. It is a priceless relic after all i'm surprised i'm surprised you can stand to to work uh, that close to a corpse um yeah i'm pretty sure whatever Kratos is planning it involves a giant hammer here but uh let's deal with these crystals um i guess Kratos will have to do that i mean that didn't do much but we have more of them And, I mean, there's probably one on this one too, right? <laughs> oh, oh, so you will have to shoot this one while it's moving, Atreus. Careful! My shop's right here! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't mean to endanger you. Um, all right. I think, I think we can move on now. Where exactly, where exactly do we move on though? Probably over here. Okay, yep, this is it. <laughs> Look at his beard. We heading into that building? Yes. You think there's something inside that'll help us break the ice and get to the chisel tip? No. Mm. <laughs> I'll keep thinking. Yeah, my guess is the hammer. Seems fairly obvious. Oh, who the hell am I? Um. I'm guessing you're dangerous, huh? Well, that did absolutely nothing. And Atreus's arrows aren't doing anything either. Um, um, okay. This, this is a new enemy. I have to find out what kind of strategy to use on him. Oh, well, that is an unblockable attack. Okay. Gotta stay away from that. 
Okay, it seems that at least my rune is doing a bit of damage here, but... The normal attacks, at least if I attack from the back... Oh, uh, there's like a up there. Um, okay. Well, I might use this to my advantage if I can properly deflect the bombs against the knight. Oh, well, um, I'm not sure if, if that did a lot of damage. As a matter of fact, I may have killed the Draugr and not actually damaged the knight. Oh, what the hell are you doing? Yeah, so far, nothing really seems to damage him all that much. And now we have more Draugrs here. Um... Let's maybe wait for another bomb. Oh, well, um, I gotta get away from this one, though. Oh, what the hell are you doing now? Oh, um, okay. I see. That's what you're doing. Anyway, um, I feel... The Draugrs are not really helping me here, because I, I'm not sure if the bombs are even hitting the knight. Why are you doing this again? Let's see if I can... Oh, well... What the hell? How... How can I... How can I hurt you? Alright, at least we have a bit of health here. Oh great. Um well, can I at least block this attack? Okay, I can. That is at least some good news. So I guess I have to attack him when he's not in this kind of stand because the shield is practically impenetrable. And I might be able to get in a few hits. Nope, not really. Not really. Alright, gotta block this one. I mean, I'm doing like very small incremental amounts of damage here. Oh, well. Let me evade this one. Yeah, I feel after evading after he's done with one of his attacks might be the right opportunity for for a counter attack all right and i have seen that at least this room is doing some damage oh i think we actually managed to destroy his armor or parts of it anyway Okay, so we're finally getting somewhere here. Sorry, not oh, but you still can do this attack, apparently. <laughs> Atreus, maybe, maybe you shouldn't be quite as, as close to him. Okay. Let's wait for the right time to attack. Taking the shield is not going to damage him in any form. Oh, well! Okay, I think... I think we finally did it. Can't believe we got through that. Yeah. That is... that is new. Travels end. Kill travelers. Encounter more of these heavily armored swordsmen by thoroughly exploring the lands you traverse. Consult the bestiary for tips on defeating them. Yeah, I definitely would like some tips on that because... That was kind of difficult. This traveler has a huge shield on his back, which makes breaking through his extremely tough armor even tougher. Well, thank you. <laughs> that is not advice at all. But yeah, I feel that um, besides the runes, um, 
trying to attack him whenever he has finished one of his attacks. That might be his vulnerable um, moment. But okay, let's pick up all of this. We will show it to the dwarves. Oh, I guess this might be something we can use to craft. Craft the traveler's armor. Oh. Okay. Anyway, um, I guess we are done here. So this is the proper way out. Come here. You knew this place before. I came here on a diplomatic mission once, trying to broker a peace between Asgard and Vanaheim. Hmm. That war, so many lives lost. What I didn't know was Thor had already gone on a killing spree of giants. What did the giants have to do with the war between the gods? Nothing at all, lad. <laughs> That's the tragedy of it. They took no side in that madness. But Odin's paranoia is surpassed only by Thor's lust for blood. I feel I might be able to do something with this giant stone. The problem is, he's... okay. Just, just stop pulling it. He's automatically pulling it all the way over here for some reason. But, okay, I can actually jump over here now, apparently. If I am at the right angle. Oh, here we go. Um, yeah, we'll check out that door later. First, let's see what we have here, if anything. Oh, I may have to do something with these round thingies first. Okay. And I guess I may as well pick up that crystal over here. Huh? Um, yeah. okay, let's see. What can we do here? <laughs> oh, I can turn it around, the whole thing. sure if this is helping me in any form <laughs> but let's give it a try I mean clearly um, there's like a chest over there well maybe it has to be in a different position and if I then can move the stone again might be able to still climb on it I don't know, let's give this a try okay let's see if, if that is helping me in any form okay it might it might There we go. Nice. So what do you have for me? Blessing of the Frost. Heavy runic attack. Um... Okay. But... Honestly... This is still one of my favorite favorite attacks so at the moment I see no reason to change it I may change the light runic attack at some point but I'm I'm really really happy with the heavy runic attack so I guess that's all I can do here okay in that case let's keep going Um, okay. So, where exactly are we going to now? Well, I do see like a chest in here, so may as well pick this up before we continue. Nice. 
but I have to go up so ah I can climb onto this side as well I see um okay ah, okay can jump over here and now up here all right and now we are like underneath the giant hammer another crystal just give the word yeah I'll I'll let you know in a second but first <laughs> let me uh, get to that chest over here it's not that easy it's it's blocked by ice <laughs> you would think that craters can destroy a bit of ice but Hmm, apparently not. Okay, um, let's see what happens if we shoot the crystal. Huh. What now? Hmm. Hmm. Good question. Ooh, I can I can climb it. Well Oh, I'm not climbing it, I'm just moving it. Okay. I think... I think I understand. Uh-huh. Oh, you got most of it. But... I still wonder how we can get to this chest over here. I mean, if I could somehow move the crystal over in that direction, I might be able to destroy the ice. Uh-oh. Well, we certainly accomplished something here. Oh, it's, it's hanging by a thread. Huh. Well, okay. a stealthy plan it is not. Now well, we must free the other strap. We do? When was Kratos ever stealthy? Okay, now we might be able to make this ice explode. There we go. Okay. That's more like it. So, um, Thamua, what are we going to do with your hammer now? <laughs> and yeah, like I said, I, I'm not familiar with the name Thamua or the story that Mimir um, told us last episode. So, it may just be a story that I'm, you know, not familiar with, but maybe they actually invented it for, for the game. Okay, now, now we can jump over here. Yeah, I thought we should uh, have been able to climb it because of. Why are we going up? And what we need is all the way down there. Marking seal. Thick. Well, the chisel tip is under thick layers of ice, so melting it won't work. Correct. And there weren't any shattered crystals nearby for me to shoot, so that's not an option. Correct. I just leave smashing the ice. We need something ridiculously heavy to. <laughs> oh. I get it. Good. It's not that difficult, right? Okay. Now we are on the other side of it. How are we going to turn the hammer so it lands near the chisel tip? Not possible. <laughs> we cut it free, write it down, and figure out what comes next after. So your plan involves a whole bunch of luck then? You are welcome to suggest <laughs> a different one. Yeah, this sounds like a terrible plan. Like a really, really terrible plan, but okay. There we go. And onwards we move.
Release the strap. What now? Hold tight. Hmm. Hmm. Are you sure about this, Kratos? Are you really, really sure about this? This, this seems like a recipe for disaster, but okay. We're gods, right? So we shouldn't die that easily. <laughs> Uh, the plan seems ill-advised. Yep, I agree. Jump. Huh. Had some work. It only fell a little ways. Yeah. It's it's not coming down. Find a way to the hammer's head. So we need to get back up again, or well, even higher than before. Oh boy. Um Yeah, I'm I'm guessing I can't climb this way. So we're going to take the door. What do we got here? Hmm. Rune Weaver War Belt. Is this something that I want? Hmm. I'm not sure if I really need luck all that uh, badly. And I do like the increased runic and defense. I think I'm going to take it. Again, it's not as um, good looking as the previous one, but whatever. Oh, I can't put a rune into this one. But I mean, it still has like better stats than the one I had before. So I'm going to keep it for now anyway. All right. Now, let's see. Um Oh no, the floor's collapsed. There's a sand bowl, but how do we get to it? We cannot. Huh. Well, maybe you can. That seems large enough for you. Yep. Well, don't need that. So... What does it say? When time itself is deserted, the forward path is retrograde. Retrograde? It's backwards? Those symbols. The seasons? Yeah, but the order's all jumbled. Shouldn't it be winter, spring, summer, autumn? Why start with winter? It's from a song Mother used to sing. Do I know that one? Winter <laughs> Quiet head. Doesn't like music either. Got it. Kratos doesn't like anything. Don't bother, Mimir. So I see. These are the symbols for the seasons and <laughs> Ah, okay, I can use this to turn them. So I have to bring them into their proper order. Only <laughs> starting with winter. I mean that seems to be a typical winter symbol. Um, I'm guessing that this is supposed to be summer, spring, summer, and now I need autumn. The leaf. Okay. Right. It. Vet, flower, sewer, house. Hmm. It didn't work, but I know that's the order in the song, Mom's. Okay, but I mean, the clue said something about being backwards. So maybe I actually have to use that order, but backwards. <laughs> Meaning I'm going to start with winter on this side. That's probably <laughs> the, the problem here. <laughs> and finally... <laughs> Okay. Try again, boy. Try that. House. Sumo. Uh -huh. Yes. That did the trick. Atreus. That word. Thola. It means endure. Try it. Thola. 
Ooh. Ooh. Well done, lad. Fascinating. Write it again. Solar. Horizon. The energy's lifting the platform. Huh. Keep writing. Well, this is different. Ed, how is this possible? My guess, temporal magic. <laughs> Dangerous stuff the High Vanier gods used to play around with. The ability to freeze time. Happened to be a favorite of Njord himself, in fact. Interesting. You used to. Why did they stop? Well, turns out stopping time keeps the sun and moon from streaking across the sky. <laughs> Unfortunately, it does not stop the wolves that chase them. Always looking to sink their teeth in. Oh. After that, they decided it was best to leave time alone. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well. I can't get to the ball. It's okay. I'm going to get rid of the enemies, and you can continue to uh, ride in the bowl, hopefully. And well, there's already the next wave. Alright, I think you can go back, oh no, there's one over here that I haven't seen. There we go. And it seems that I'm on some kind of timer here. This is like the amount of time that I have to keep fighting enemies or what happens if the timer runs out. I'm a little bit concerned about this. Okay, you're still alive, but not for much longer. Okay, and another one. And another one. Oh no! clear! Back to writing before the floor collapses. Okay. So maybe the time is the amount of time I. I have to defeat all the enemies. Because now the time has gone. Well, this is definitely something new. Oh no, oh no. We have the next wave of enemies waiting for us already. Okay. I guess the fastest way to deal with them is to actually push them over the ledge. If I can do that to a few more of them. That would certainly speed things up a little bit. Okay, um, now we have a whole bunch of them over here. Just the right moment for a nice rune. Alright, you are down. Okay. Well, maybe you can go back and continue to raise the platform. We're good. Okay, we're good. So that's where we have to go, probably. See some crystals over here, but they're behind eyes. All right. And yes, of course. This this isn't this isn't this isn't everything yet. Now we have some annoying nightmares. I mean, these battles are not exactly hard, but I'm a little bit concerned about about the timer. All right, now we're back. Draugus, apparently. Okay. You are down. Oh, well, um... There's a lot of them now. Yes, I can... I can see that. But... We need to deal with all these Draugus first. Okay, 
Oh no! Now we have a Reaver here! Well, maybe I should just use my my rage. Since we don't really have that much time left. Well, you need to help me with that Reaver over here. Alright, there we go. Okay, I'm going to pick up some of the crystals. Oh, um, can you shoot these crystals over here? Uh, well... Yeah, I noticed that. I think you will have to shoot the crystals. Okay, now we can get over here. Well, <laughs> wow, well, that was very exciting. You did well. Thanks. The boy. <laughs> Just having a little fun, you big drunk. Well, to be fair, Mimi didn't really do anything. The hammer's head. Okay, so we made it all the way to the top. But now we need to make sure that well, there the it is. hammer lands in the right position. A push. But trust me. Mm. I don't know if I want to trust Dig your plan. Push with everything. Yes, sir. Let's do it. How do we get down? We jump. <laughs> Come. Ah, uh, really? Would it? Do not panic. Would it have Why killed you panic? to find another way down? I, I mean, it might kill you to use this way down. Oh dear. Oh dear. Bad idea. Very bad idea. You're cracked, you know that. Well, well, well. Good. We should keep moving. Okay. Well, I think we can be glad that the eyes here stopped the hammer's fall and it didn't go all the way to the bottom. Uh oh. What is happening now? The chisel tip. Give the man credit. He has a talent for destroying things. <laughs> Remember that head. Never leaves my mind. That he has. That he has. Okay, so now I just have to get to the other side of this and pick up the chisel tip. Well, um, that was a very exciting episode. Lots of new stuff. A new kind of enemy. A little ride on a falling hammer. And a ride on a rising platform. <laughs> But I think um, the episode is long enough now, so I'm going to make a cut here, as always. Thank you for watching, and see you again next time.